become a member of the United Nations Security Council. Unfortunately, my appearance today has been clouded by a flurry of speculation that my company is developing a weapon of mass destruction which would be capable of targeting specific ethnic groups. I want to address these allegations head on. Are we developing such a weapon? No, we are not. Because we've already developed it. But with all due respect, the United Nations is a relic from a different time when nations were unique in their ability to solve the world's problems. But that just isn't the case anymore, primarily because you have outsourced the job to me. I have sent people to die in your wars. So I feel uniquely qualified to tell you, your wars don't work. Which is why my priorities have changed from profits to policy, because politicians don't know how to solve problems, but I do. So let's be clear. I am here to solve the world's problems. And I believe the world's problems begin with you. So what the hell was that? Couldn't tell you, mate. But it sounded an awful lot like Heinz declaring war. We took out his WMDs without Manicor. Atlas didn't stand a chance. Cormac, you need to see this. Talk to me. We cracked the encryption on the last set of uploads. What am I looking at? Potential targets. I ain't had a fallback plan if Atlas was ever backed into a corner. The preemptive strike. He's gonna try to knock us out before the fight has even begun. But a direct attack on the US? Are we sure Irons is even up for that? So what's the play? No way Atlas can hit him all at once. San Francisco. The entire third fleet is in the bay. I need you two on the ground. Now. with commercial place just jump the checkpoint we're in pursuit there could be anything inside that van pursue but do not engage punch it Mitchell stay on it three more vehicles just broke the checkpoint they're heading your way how the hell did ISR miss these bastards
got the van box kid. 50 meters. Get out of the assist. van! On the ground! On the goddamn ground! We got the driver! 